I recently reviewed an 8 ounce bag, which only cost $10, from the eBay seller Find the Line. And that came out so good that I decided to give one of his, one of his higher end bags a try. This time it's a one pound bag of what looks like concentrates more th than pay dirt because there doesn't seem to be a whole lot of uh, silt in it. This was $55 and $7 shipping, so $62 total. Let's uh, open her up and see what we have. And here we go. No dust at all, very clean material. Nice and granular, and I don't see much in the way of silt. The big thing though is that it weighs uh, almost one pound five ounces. Again, it's always nice to get more than what you, what's advertised. Let's do the classification and we'll see what it looks like. All right, I have good news and I have bad news. The good news is, is this is very clean material. You're not gonna have to do any silt clean out at all. It's, it's probably not gonna make your panning water muddy. The bad news is there is a lot of black sand in this, so you're probably gonna to wanna to use magnetic separation before you get it into your pan. Let's uh, start the hand picking and uh, run it over the miller table and see if there's any gold in this stuff. And here's what the hand picking produced. A real nice beefy little nugget that weighed in at almost half a gram. This was in the plus four mesh. The plus 10 mesh picked up one piece. It looks pretty big, but it's paper thin. Here's the plus 20. Lots and lots in the plus 30. Then I went to the Miller table and I found two more plus 20s. Here's the plus 30, plus 60, a few in the plus 70s and probably close to 100 in the minus 70. And some of this stuff is microscopic. Even with 10 power glasses on, this stuff is almost impossible to see. So there's probably a lot of minus 100 mesh material in here, which is interesting because this is quite a bit different than what I got out of the eight ounce sack I reviewed earlier in which there was nothing below 60 mesh. So this is looking really good. Let's uh, get it on the scale and see what we got. It looks like 1.268 grams. Let's crank the numbers and see what it looks like. For reviews of 50 other pay dirts, I'll hope you visit the Backyard Gold Prospecting section of my main website, waynesthisandthat.com.